Hello again, it's Lock Noob, and uh, through the post today came this really, really awesome looking package from Legal Lock Picker. Um, it's really quite big, in fact, it only just fits in, in camera frame as it is. Now, for those of you who don't know, Legal Lock Picker um, is another YouTuber. He's got a really great channel. He's been going for, I think, just under a year, but in that time has already picked up over a thousand subscribers and has over a hundred videos. And I have to say, um, he's really come out swinging because the, his content is at a level that mine wasn't at, oh, for at least a couple of years into my YouTube journey. Uh, I, I mean, you know, in terms of his, the, the production quality and the type of videos he's putting out there, I mean, just go check it out, really. It's, it's definitely, definitely worth your time. And Legal Lockpicker is definitely one of those lockpicking channels to uh, look out for um, in the future as well. So, yeah, go check them out. Right. That being said, I, I want to know what's inside here. Sorry. Um, it's, it's all well and good kind of like, um, you know, pointing people to uh, Legal Lockpicker's channel. But, um, yeah, not when there's a big parcel of stuff in here that I just want to have a look inside so um, I don't know how to do this and still sort of get it on camera so I'm going to go in through the side and try not to scratch everything up with this uh, standing knife or box cutter or whatever terminology you wish so let's have a peek through okay no it doesn't look like I've destroyed anything so far I mean um, 10 out of 10 for for Making the packaging look a bit nicer than normal. Okay, so um, I don't know where to start. There is nowhere to start, so we will just start here. Okay, put it like that, and then, oh, maybe that is a bad place to start. <laughs> uh, let's pull this one out. It's like, what can I pull out of the package? There's a key. That's it, all right, brilliant, video over. No, joking. Um, oh, right, what's this? What's this falling out? So this is... A little kick cylinder, but it's not a make that I'm familiar with. This is a Pele, as in the footballer. Little five pin um, Pele lock with not unreasonable bitting. What kind of keyway? Sort of standard Schlegsar keyway there. Cool, I never picked a Pele before. That's awesome. Um, I'm going to try to keep things sort of on camera, but it depends on how many locks there are in here. Okay, what's this? So we're going to go in with the big shiny thing. Ah, oh, I saw that in one of his videos. This is, um, I mean, this is beautiful, isn't it? And here is the, the kick cylinder and the front plate and, and other bits to it, the ball bearings. Um, but this is the, the body for this little um, kick cylinder that comes with it. And that is the Asa Abloy Lockwood 30163. And what a beautiful lock that is. Oh, look, there's even a tiny, tiny spring there, which will go somewhere. No doubt I'll find it. It's probably the um, spring for the uh, little pin that's at the back here. But again, we'll, we'll figure it out, no doubt. Right. Uh with that to one side, put that over there. Right, what else do we have? Will this free up yet? Oh, uh, there's some. And, oh, there's another little thing in the back of the box. All right, let's have a look at the other little thing at the back of the box. It's fully sealed up, so let's have an open. It says a little transatlantic company, Taco. And who doesn't like tacos? Mailbox lock. This is going to be cute. I already know it's going to be pretty cute. Whoa, here we go. Um, wow, every uh, back piece in that cam that you could possibly want. And that's a cute little thing, isn't it? Awesome. One tasty taco. Ah! Right, okay. That's only a tail piece. It's fine, it's fine. We'll survive. We'll su In fact, I think I found it. Just fell into a drawer nearby. There we go. Awesome. That's um, the first taco lock I'll have picked. 
over there. Uh, and, and another package. Right, where's that knife again? And again, just going to be very careful scoring through this. Got to say, very well packaged. Oh, wow, a heap of locks. Okay. So, ooh. So this is a Brinks commercial squeeze to open. <gasps> it does. You squeeze it and it opens. So what kind of lock is it? What do you do? Is it, does it have a key? How do you, how do you work it? What goes on? I don't understand. It's a it's a combination lock. It's a combination lock. Right. So cool. I will check out one of these combination locks. I wonder if it can be bypassed. I don't know. Ah, uh, made in Taiwan, but it's kind of cute, isn't it? This is a luster line, full of luster. Okay. What else? Ah. Uh, oh. Ooh. That's not one I recognise. Is that the key? Could be the key. looks like it's or feels like it's aluminium and this is a cl the club the club the key fits but it doesn't open the lock i don't know why i guess we'll have to pick that and find out but that is the key that came with it i think the club uh what's this one another little cam lock what's this blue thing Come here. This is a lotto lock. Uh, don't recognize the brand and it's, uh, oh, it's a, look, it's a slider one. Don't think I'll be picking that anytime soon. Um, well, then again, that middle track looks like it might be false and actually it just might be a double bitted wafer. So maybe I could pick that. We'll see. That's kind of cool. All right. I don't know the make, but that's sort of awesome. What's this? Ah, ah, I wonder whether it's just got the same keyway and this goes in. Yeah, there we go. True value. Actually really nice. Reminds me of a, a brass sesame lock. Can't um, repin this by the looks of things, but it does have ball bearing mechanism. Very, very nice. And let's have a look. There we go. Yep, little anime. Reminds me of the Squire South 40, that one. So many other things in here. Right. Um, oh. Okay, what's this blue one? This looks like an Abus 7240, but it's not. But it looks like it is, but it's not. It's a unbranded blue Aber 7240 alike. And a little pack lock core. That's kind of cool. With a oh, very light feeling combination lock set to all zeros, but We'll see if we can defeat that. What's this one? Oh, that's the safety lock. That bl um, that blue one, but it still doesn't say anything about who makes it. How strange. And I think last, but definitely not least, an Ace Hardware um, night latch cylinder. Or rim cylinder very cool wow i mean that's a pile of locks isn't it so many cool things in there to look at um so legal lock picker that is really awesome of you really appreciate this there's so many locks here to get into and have fun with i can't wait to pick some of them um again please go check out legal lock pickers channel i don't think you'll be disappointed um like i said for someone who's been doing this for a, about a year uh the quality of his video stands for itself that's for sure right thank you all so much for watching thank you again to legal lock picker um and yeah 
keep watching and I'll see you all next time.